Hey guys, JG here. So, today's a Hot Wheels update. It's a basic video. So, my Hot Wheels update is, I basically go over the cars, what has changed. So, we're going to do that in this video. And first, one thing is, my plans for the Project Blackout has... Well, it might happen, it might not happen. I have to get permission from my brother to take the Tesla because he took the Tesla back because he actually decided to rejoin again. But he didn't take every car back. He took very few, he just took these very few cars right here. That's all he took. He didn't like take every single car. He just took like five cars and that's it. That's all that he really took. So I'm gonna just park them nicely for him. Just, just toss them on the table and got them on completely. We well, took the red Mustang back, his Tesla, some other cars. I'll mine it up. See? That's what he took basically. So let's go back to my parking lot. So that's my overview. So. Don't get too excited about the Hot Wheels blackout experiment. I have to get permission to my brother, but I might do a couple modifications to it because I have done modifications to it in the past. Like the black wheels. I, now, I didn't record at the time when I did paint those wheels black with Sharpie. I, I used Sharpie. Well, not Sharpie, it's black marker. That's like dry erase. It... So, the black marker, I just colored the wheels with them. I did use Sharpie a couple times to color the wheels permanently because, well, the wheels were all worn out. Like, the, like you know what I'm talking about, like these chrome rims so the chrome rims actually were worn out on the little what are they called I don't know what it's called but they're called like you'll probably mention it in the comments but the little bars here see them like the edges had chrome the bars were all like worn out and the middle had chrome. It looked really bad. And I colored these wheels like back in like October. Like it was a long time ago. It was like about three months ago. Cause I got I got the car and it the wheels were already like that. They were already like the already the wheels were already like worn out. The roof was broken. I I didn't. I wasn't very satisfied with the car, and the car was really like it wasn't manufactured right. And my brother fixed the roof on the car. Now all the problem was the wheels. I so maybe about a couple weeks later, I colored them black, and they've been that way ever since then. And that was like three months ago. And the wheels were always black. So the wheels were black most of the time. Uh, this is basically an exact replica of it. But this is like no modifications to it. I did not paint the wheels at all. These are, this is the way it came. So this is what the car would, should have looked like when I got the black Model X. Well, it's my brother's now. So when I first bought it at Walmart, when I first bought it at Walmart, I found it. It was at Walmart in Bristol, Connecticut. And I saw the package. I was starting to suspect that the roof was, like, there's something wrong with the roof. And I was suspecting something about that. And I noticed the wheels were scraped. I was like, no big deal. I, I'll be able to fix it. I come home. 
and I figured out that the roof was actually broken. And I was kind of a little upset about it. So I was like, you know what? I want to go back to Walmart the next day and get another one. And my my brother was like, okay, I'll take it. And he threw it across the room and actually fixed the roof on the car. And I was like, oh, great. You got a usable car now. And then I painted the wheels black. And, and the car looked like it was a good car. And that's it, really. And that next day, well, the day after I bought that black Model X, my Model X, my silver one, I bought that next day, October, October 7th, 2018, was the day I bought it. I bought that October 6th. And so here's my mo silver Model X, and I've had it for three months, over, almost four months now. And uh, this came with no broken roof. It has the nice gray rims. And... And, well, that's it. And then I got this, this like, early January. So, so, we call my brother's Tesla the blacked, the blacked out Tesla. It is blacked out, like, look at it. Black rims. Black, I call it, like, the spy mobile, more like. It's very, Whoa. like, dark and watch out. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Well, my, well, my Tesla has the dark, has really dark windows. Can't even see the color of the seats in there. But they are like a beige color, but the, the windows are so dark that they're like really dark. And make the seats look, you can't even see them. Well, we have. You have to like put it up to sunlight and you'll well, see guys, them. we have a, a fixer machine. Yeah, cars with this so that'll be the end of the Tesla story. So next story will be this thing. <laughs> uh, this is actually from Matchbox. And it came with the Jurassic Park thing. It was like it's something really from... Fix and there you go. Yeah, so... Sorry, anyone. And I want to talk about a re resemblance in this... My Honda... My blue Honda CRX, 1985 CRX. This car kind of reminds me of a DeLorean, you know? Those cars from Back to the Future. If you haven't watched it, or look up DeLorean, and you'll find... See, the rear window is very similar to a DeLorean. It just doesn't have those super doors. That's all, really. Plus, it's very small, so... But the rear window kind of reminds me of a DeLorean, so. Its shape kind of reminds me of it. Except for this big, like, cool, like, little, don't know what. So, this car, most of my cars are not modified. Like, the only car that I really modified was, well, my brother's Tesla, my his black Mono X. It's like all blacked out and all cool and stuff. And I'm kind of glad I did paint those wheels black. Because now we know which car's which. Because without it, we won't even notice a difference. Now you know, like, this is my Tesla. The other one's my brother's because of the black wheels. That's why. So that'll be it for Hot Wheels update and I'll see you in the next video tomorrow at seven o'clock Eastern time. I'll, I have a set I set a permanent time and I will be uploading at seven o'clock Eastern time. Sometimes earlier. Depends. Depends on what I have to do that day. So, sometimes I'll be uploading in the morning, sometimes midday, 3 o'clock, sometimes at 7. But it'll be mainly at 7 o'clock on a regular weekday. And uh, that'll be it for my plans on when, what, what I'll be doing for the videos. 
So that'll be it for this video. And I'll be uploading tomorrow.